disturbing noises. Like Murlocs? Oh god, no, that would be horrifying. Imagine that, all the monsters in the game are murlocs. Oh god. Okay. Um, for those of you who haven't played World of Warcraft, murlocs are like little, little fish frog people men with things. spears. Nasty. 17th of 17th May, of May 1839. 1839. My, my hands tremble as I write. I feel I need to document my tribulation, for I fear that my memory will fail me if I linger. Today, I took some men and ventured into the dark, ancient passage we uncovered. Our torches burned faintly in the murky air as we slowly made our way underground. The men were superstitious and fearful. They argued loudly, and I felt their strange language getting to me. I mustered my strength and yelled at them to continue down the slopes and broken steps. The crudely carved passage confused me. It looked much older than the 4th century structure we had expected. The twisting path emerged into a great antechamber. The walls were lined with statues unlike any I had ever seen. Despite their unearthly quality, I felt a strange familiarity toward them, which haunts me still. At the far end of the chamber, a great slab of stone sealed off whatever lay ahead. I gave the order to raise it, and as I pushed through the narrow space, the heavy stone suddenly dropped, sealing me inside. I was trapped. I was trapped. No shit. <laughs> Wow. wow, I just love your reading and how you just take words and combine them in the words that don't actually exist. I'm reading, I'm listening to the audio and I'm trying to read it the same okay. way he is. But, but. Oh, burn. No. Oh, it exploded. You know you have a lantern, you can use it. Everything's all wibbly. Uh. Oh, book! The book fell. Light. Do you hear a piano? Mm, yeah, I think there is a piano somewhere. What the hell? Uh, now I'm getting serenaded? Serenaded to death! <laughs> Don't run away, just stay inside so I can murder your face. I didn't want yeah, to don't uh, keep your day job. Don't try singing. I'm not going to sing. Mm -hmm. Boxes. Uh, it's like one of the few things I can pick up and actually enjoy. Probably wasted a tin box there, but whatever. Remember, people, do not waste your tinder boxes, because you're probably not coming back to the area. I have 16 tinder boxes. Holy yep. crap, that's a lot of tinder boxes. Well, you've been collecting them like a madman. Well, for good reason. I'm going to need them later on. Oh, look, there's the piano. Look! <laughs> I guess I didn't want to play. I guess not. Okay. I'd say keep walking. Wait, wait, look out the window, look out the window. What? The f what? It's snowing outside. I, I just heard like a moan like. So if I see him. If I see a monster, I'm gonna be running away like hell. Oh, I could light the fireplace. Uh, let's not I thought you said don't waste tinder boxes. I said I could light the fireplace. I'm like, let's not. Moaning! Plans. Plans. Plan. Plan. I just love how there's like randomly tossed about. I hear the heart beating. I 
I'm standing in light, so why is my sanity dropped? Because you were in darkness. Oh, flashback. Much of the castle is old and hasn't been tended to for centuries. When the shadow arrives, it won't take long until things start falling apart. We're just buying time anyway. Let's do what we can. Okay. There isn't much to be done about the wars. We should reinforce weak structures. The ground will tremble and there's a risk everything will cave in on us. Especially downstairs. Here, here, and there. Let's get the servants working wait, wait. on it. Aren't you supposed to go to that board that was in the thing? No, 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 not the board in the room with the plans on it. Or that, really or that room to. on the right. Thought there was something there that you need. Yeah, here are the plans. East wing, west hall. Oh, okay, never mind, I was wrong. It doesn't, it doesn't give me anything special, unfortunately. Mm -hmm. How's my old? What the? What the fuck? Huh? Ah, oh, come on! Oh, great, a cave-in. You know, this is supposed to be a really good- Wait, first of all, where are all these rocks coming from? Are they, like, just have a crap load of them on the roof? I don't know, I think it's supposed to be the walls, but whoever made the texture just kind of thought, you know what, no one's gonna question the walls. Okay, so I must find a new way out of this area. Nine out of ten oh. times when a game says that, they mean make your own exit. Okay, let's see what's in the tabula, which means maps. maps <laughs> apparently. Oh well, there's your answers to where the fucking rocks came from. I guess, yeah. Okay. Uh, anything of interest here? Yes, there is. Okay. Um, oh, hey. Going full hey. twitchy. I'm going twitchy, and I'm past. Seventeenth of May, and we're down, ladies and gentlemen. Can you hear this? Yep. After pounding the unforgiving stone wall for what seemed like an eternity, I realized it was hopeless. I was trapped. I fell to the ground, gasping for air, trying to focus. That's when I saw a faint blue oh, that? shimmer. Active flash. My weakened body was heavy to carry. But I, I managed I, I to push myself light, to and I want to advise against this. I do not feel comfortable with going towards this light. Oh, shit. This is obviously a trap. Mm. Do it if you must, but I have no part in this. It's like I can't even look away from it. My eyes just keep It was on. waiting for me. What the, that it thing closed in dark nothingness. I felt myself drawn to the mystic light. I wouldn't do that. Don't take it. I reached out. Don't be an idiot. My hands. The faint glow escaped my fingers and began yeah. to spark brightly and spirit me away, unlocking alien memories of spiraling towers, endless deserts, and impossible geometry. The next thing I can remember is the grating sound of stone being lifted, the voices of the Arabs pulling me to safety. Grasped firmly oh, in my hands again. was the broken pieces of a most peculiar relic. By the way, your vision's gonna wibble wobble. I know. box. Okay, so I'm not sure if we're reliving Daniel's memories or. Whoever wrote those notes. I think they are them. Oh, but it's breakable by my by hand, my ass. <laughs> okay. Oh, flashback. You have to be swift when you activate the first one. You hear that? If it stops, you'll have to start over. Isn't all this a bit excessive? You can never be too careful, Daniel. Nice use of the sepia tone, by the way. Ooh, what was that? Was what? I heard something. Okay, so it looks like there's going to be a book of puzzle of some sorts, but I want this paper. <laughs> Just take random box. Smash! Local folklore. 
Alstad and Brandenburg Castle, 1801. Another region rich with lore is Alstad. Deep within the East Prussia woods, for centuries, there have been stories surrounding the hamlet and its neighborhood. Castle Brandenburg, the quite forest-clad mountains, dressed with scattered lakes, is picturesque, as can be, albeit the area is haunted by the dark. Ask any local and you will hear, the pro hear proof of the widespread superstition. All travelers should indulge themselves in such conversations, since it will certainly serve as exciting entertainment. All of them have their own twists on the tale, but there are some motifs that keep reappearing. The Gatherers. This story reaches all the way back to the time of the Thirty Years' War. It is said that the soldiers who abandoned their duty got lost in the cold, dark woods and were forever damned to roam the grounds. Their bodies, wrought by the tainted souls, have left them disfigured and emptied of essence. Many have cited them over the years, and described them as horrid revenants. They move silently through the woods, shying away from any beholder. They are called gatherers, as they seem to follow some ambition to steal living creatures. It is their prey which can be heard struggling inside damp burlap sacks dragged behind them, which reveal their presence. What dark scheme do they follow? A visit undone. Heinrich Cornelius Ag Agrippa, the well-known Erudic visited Aristad at the start of the 16th century. He resided in the local inn for a fortnight, and he looked for remnants of the kingdom's past. During his stay, all prominent members of society paid notice, and he mentioned in many records at the time. One day, he went to investigate a burrow in the northwestern glades, only to never be seen again. Heinrich is known to have passed away in Grenoble some ten years later. Some ten years later, he dismissed the notion of ever visiting Alistad, which makes you wonder, what really happened? Who was this mysterious man who visited the sleepy hamlet in the woods, and what happened to him? The Immortal Baron. Oh god, let's keep going. <laughs> the Baron of Brennenberg lives in a reclusive life with his family at the castle nearby. Alistad and the, most of the noble birth rumors are inherited alongside with the title. Researching the history reveals, little before the castle was consumed by fire in the late 16th century, it was rebuilt by Alexander, a nobleman from the Rhinelands claiming the role as protector of Prussia's state. Alexander helped the region to flourish and remain popular throughout his presumed lifetime. The family has always been secretive when it comes to lineage and heritage, therefore the birth and death of Alexander and his offspring has never been fully recorded. This has fed the idea that the Baron is in fact one of the same, and the same who came over from the west over 300 years ago, lived through the time of occupation and joined the coveted order of the Black Eagle along with the great leaders of this country. Okay, so basically what you're telling me is that the Baron could possibly be the Highlander. Oh god, okay, that's one so thing we don't know. Mark Ooh, a book. book. Cole said book. Okay, uh, okay, where's the second book? Where's, where's the second book? Second book? Second book? No, is this it? Nope, that's not it. Okay, hang on. Note to self. Find all the books before pulling the freaking books. Just keep going. Okay, Probably on the other side. Aha! Oh, grab the, oh, grab the books. Secret door. How's my sanity? Slight heading. Okay, we're good. We're golden. Yeah, as long as you're not doing anything too stupid. Well, unless I don't see anything that's gonna spook me. Ooh, key. What was it? The door open. The door's open. You think? I don't know. It's like someone Hulk smash on it. Usually, if that happens, there is no door. Regarding the closing of the wine cell, Wilhelm and his fools have endangered my research long enough with their absent minded handling of the human vessels. The sheriff is keeping a watchful eye on the forest and is killing my trusty servants. 
Um, it's just a matter of time until they follow the trail to Brennenburg. I need to lock Wilhelm and his men up to avoid further investigation from the public. The wine cellar ha will 